think that there's a lot of reasons to come see Into the Woods at Lost Nation Theater, and one of them is that it is going to be visually spectacular as well as just sounding great. There's a lot of fun, there's a lot of humor, and there's a lot of heart. I think that the show has a lot more depth than, than people often think that it would. On the one hand, it relishes in what is so fun about fairy tales, the wish fulfillment, the excitement, the adventure, and at the same time, brings in what we all know about real life and how different it can be from fairy tales. I love musicals that take something that seems innocent and then just delves into it a little further that sort of twists it around a little bit. Well I think the show has a lot of messages in it and there's something for everyone. For pure entertainment we have the first act which is based on four fairy tales. It's like Sondheim and Lupine just uh, shook up the fairy tale characters and then threw them out on the table and see how they would mix up and interact and, and that the way they collide uh, really changes them and they're not the same. Everybody has a want, a wish when they start it and at the end of the first act they get it. In the second act they get the consequences of those wishes and there's a very powerful message about overcoming adversity by coming together. To see these fairy tale characters actually get what they want, but then experience the complications of that and the consequences and suffering that is a part of real life is such a rich experience and to me is so fully reflective of humanity. If there's a question of the show that the creators would have had, I think it's probably what do fairy tale characters make of the real world. It manages to be a, a family appropriate musical but it does address some very deep issues and some very deep ideas. By the end we're addressing something as big as what do our children learn from us? How do we teach our children? Even if in the beginning we begin with Little Red Riding Hood, it gets to be funny, Jack gets to be kind of stupid, and we have very just sort of fun humor. It, it can go to some very dramatically impressive places. It is a fairy tale, and in some ways it's very family friendly. <laughs> but as we've mentioned, it does have a lot of adult themes, so I think it really depends on the kid. I would say 10 and up, definitely. Um, and for that younger audience, do they enjoy performances? Do they enjoy plays? And are they ready to deal with sort of some complex themes, yeah. there will be some loud noises, there's a giant. Um, there's, there's, a little, there's a little death. Yeah. <laughs> so. And there's a lot of life into the woods. Even though we're watching the characters in fairy tales, we're watching people who are also experiencing things that are very real and relevant. It, going into the woods, like the journey of life and of what you never know what to expect. And it's deep and it's dark and there's... You may encounter wolves. You may encounter wolves and you don't know. You just never know what will happen in the woods or in life, so... <laughs> Come see Into the Woods at Lost Nation Theatre, June 1 through 18, 2017.